A rear vision or backup camera provides an image on a vehicle infotainment system display. In a small number of vehicles, you may see the backup camera display within the rear view mirror. A backup camera view is a fixed view. It cannot see cross traffic or anything underneath the bumper or outside its limited vision. While using a backup camera, a driver should do multiple checks during the backup process and should never back up their vehicle with only the use of the rear view camera. A cross traffic alert system adds onto the backup camera technology. It is designed to alert a driver to cross traffic coming from the left or right during a reverse situation. Some rear cross traffic alert systems are designed to detect or see pedestrians, cyclists, and even small children. It is always the driver's responsibility to know which system is in your vehicle. If cross traffic is detected, an icon on the dashboard will light up. Just like all driver aid technology, there is no 100% guarantee it will work, even if there is a child or object potentially in the vehicle path. You, the driver, will be responsible for any collisions or crashes, not the technology. Some rear cross-traffic alert systems also come with auto braking functions. If this type of system sees cross traffic coming and does not sense any input from the driver to stop or slow, then the system will automatically apply the vehicle brakes. But again, only if the system sees what is in the vehicle path. Some vehicles have proximity alert or warning capability. Proximity sensors are normally associated with vehicle front and side cameras. As a vehicle gets close to whatever the sensor or camera perceives as a solid object, the driver will hear an audible alert and also see a changing visual scale on the vehicle's infotainment system. Some vehicles are equipped with surround vision technology. This usually involves multiple cameras built into the vehicle's side mirrors, above the rear license plate, and in the vehicle front grille area. Please understand, Surround cameras will not see 100% of the area around a vehicle. They have blind spots at the corners of the vehicle and should never be relied on 100%. Here's a quick note. I carry a couple of extra tissues around these days because when it's raining, most backup cameras will become totally obscured by the rainwater. Wiping off the camera before you get in the car helps clear things up. Backup cameras are a tough one. There are numerous questions surrounding how they can be used safely. Many backup cameras show a large, clear, high-definition image out the back of the vehicle. Some vehicles now even come with a video rear view camera which shows a much wider surrounding view. But it is vitally important for the driver to turn and check over their shoulder while backing up in order to see constantly changing traffic conditions, cross traffic, pedestrians, cyclists, children, and more. Many drivers are using only the backup camera to handle vehicle reversing, and this raises an issue. However, it does provide a useful view before I start reversing. I always glance in both side mirrors before moving, just in case a pedestrian or child might be standing next to my vehicle. While reversing, I am always turned around to look and check out the rear window of my vehicle. I have a point to make right here. I strongly question the wisdom of TV commercials showing this type of technology with children in the vehicle and a completely distracted driver reversing down a driveway, relying 100% on the technology to save the driver from hitting a pedestrian. This technology is not 100% effective. There are numerous reasons why the technology may not work and they are all listed in the vehicle manual. It is the driver's responsibility to back up safely not the backup technology.